So hey babes and welcome back. I'm starting back off this week with a video with the vlog. Y'all already know last week I uploaded two videos. <laughs> Kudos to me. I'm trying to stay on it y'all. So it's the little things that get me through. But last week I uploaded two videos. Uh, a haul. If y'all haven't checked that out, go check that out. And I uploaded a get ready with me getting ready for the haul. But this week is a vlog because it's spring break week. Today was my first week. My first day off for the week, and to be honest, I'm a little bit lazy. Like, it's Monday, I was supposed to do all these things. I was supposed to go to the beauty supply today, so that's gonna bring up my agenda of what's next. But I was supposed to go to the beauty supply to get some braiding hair because tomorrow I'm getting braids at 3 30. Um, I'm supposed to blow dry my hair, so that's why it's just freshly washed. I'm gonna blow dry it after I get done eating. Um, my mama made crawfish, so I'm gonna go eat some crawfish. I had crawfish literally yesterday with my boyfriend and his cousin. And I'm eating it again today. That's how it be. When it's crawfish season, you can literally eat it every day. Nobody gets tired of it. I love it. I'm gonna go eat crawfish, and I'm gonna do my hair. And that's really it for today. Um, tomorrow I'm going to lunch with my friends. Uh, at this Mexican restaurant and then tomorrow I also get my hair done later in the day I did not want to get my hair done that late I usually would never pick a 3 30 appointment but I told y'all I want to get my hair done for spring break and that's all I had look at all this water on me I just got out the shower washing my hair but yeah let's go eat we can go eat and talk while well, I'm trying to just talk all right here oh since I'm right here today was crazy you guys so today um Today, my mama, well, yesterday, really, she finished making grease. If Y'all y'all don't know, but I'm going to show my friends. But y'all don't know, my mama makes homemade grease. Uh, it's the grease I've been using for my whole life. Been growing my hair. I love it. If if you know me and my family, then you know y'all love it, too. But my mama also only makes it, like, really twice a year. But she makes a lot that will last us throughout the year if she gives it away. Or it, she'll make a big batches for us. So she made it for her time of the year and I just she decided to sell it because a lot of people like it and she's always giving it away for free but it costs so much to make so I was like you should start selling it. I already know a lot of people that's willing to buy it because people be like oh I want to buy your mama grease like she needs to make some more I'll buy it at this point because she usually gives it away. So I'm like okay let's sell it. So she made 60 jars and so far we already sold like freaking 20 something jars in just today and people just like loving it even like my family they showing good love about it like telling people that's interested in it like get this this stuff is true like but yeah this is the little jars that it come in and it's just like grease or whatever um so if you're in the Houston area my Instagram is down below you can go to my Instagram and DM me or DM me Twitter, DM me, you can't DM me here, but I guess you can put some down, down in the comments if you live in the Houston area. We can probably uh, get you one of these grease. They're $10 per jar. So, yeah, this will last you a good while because you don't necessarily grease your hair every day, but this is like super growth for your hair, honestly. I'm not lying. I've been using it since, y'all gonna see my hair when I blow dry it, but I mean, my hair's been the way it is since my mommy used the grease. But yeah, let's go eat. You know you gotta have your bag because you gotta throw them out in the trash, not in your house. Ooh, I wonder do people be doing that, like being lazy and not throwing their crawfish out. I know their house be stinking. I got cranberry juice. It was all I had out of water. And I didn't really, I mean, no, out of apple juice and water. And I didn't really want no apple juice. So I just did cranberry, whatever. Because it's a whole bunch of soda in my house. I don't drink soda either. So, yeah, let's get started.
with all this sauce I made. It's so good. I got it from, hold on. I got it from J Jai's, Jai's cookbook that I had bought. She has like a crab boil, seafood boil sauce that she puts on top of hers. And it's really good. I didn't make it directly like hers, but I have made it like hers before. I didn't have everything I needed to make it directly like hers, but it's still good, like, even if you miss out on the ingredient. Mm, mm, mm. <clears throat> Y'all been eating so bad lately. I literally just ate pizza before this. But that wasn't even my lunch. I had Wendy's. Ooh, this is a big one. Look at it. Okay, y'all. So I finished eating. I'm good and full. I already know my stomach gonna be hurt. Every time I get crawfish, the flavor it just makes me my stomach crazy. I'm gonna tell you how I blow dry my hair. Move. I did put some conditioner on my hair. I know some people blow dry, blow dry their hair like before they get braids. The person that braids your hair, whatever, be like. Um, hair blow dry, blow dry, completely straight with no product in it. Um, no, I'm not about to do that. I don't care what it is. I just cannot just blow dry my hair with heat protectant. Like, yes, I use a heat protectant, but it's not enough. I put a little layer of conditioner. Like, I feel like you need, I feel like you need a like a little layer of moisture before you just dry out your hair like that. So. I do put like a small thinner layer of conditioner on both sides. So this is my hair. I need a comb and a petal brush. Touch my body. Touch my body. Touch my body. Touch my body. So you guys, this is the heat spray I'm using. It's from Pantene. It's the heat and prime or whatever. I'm just, I just go all over that section. Cause girl, anybody trying to have heat damage, I'm trying to grow, not destroy. Touch my body, touch my body. What you been waiting for me to wait into? In my imagination, I'll be all up for you. I know you got that fever for me, hundred and two. And all I know, I feel the same. My temperature through the roof. If it's a camera up in here, then it's only you for me. blow dry my hair the day before because this is how it needs to look for my appointment and it's gonna have like a little small wave to it tomorrow because it's supposed to rain tomorrow the humidity is bad so I gotta try to keep it dry I might wear my little thing tomorrow y'all so I finished my hair I put it in a scarf <laughs> look how it look and now I got my bonnet on to sleep in so I'm all ready for tomorrow, thank God. Um, the only thing I gotta do still is get the hair. I really wish I would've got it, cause then I wouldn't have nothing to do in the morning. <sighs> but it's okay. <clears throat> so y'all know I'm getting my hair done right, so I got this from Amazon. Let's just open some packages. So I'm getting my hair done, so I got these beads. Oh my God, they're so big. Do I want, dang, these things are big. They didn't even look this big in the pictures. So I wanted to get a different set of beads for my braids to go at the bottom. At least they have them like where well, you don't have to. At least they already separated. These 
These are so big. I don't know if I want to put them on here. They did not look this big in the picture, but like they're multiple colors. So you have the white, the brown, black, and dark brown. I don't know if I want to do this. They so big. Oh my God. That's what you get sometimes when you order online. I've been trying to act like I'm a pro at ordering online, but I'm not. They give you these big old boxes for nothing. So you guys, I ordered a tripod so I can start taking my own pictures. Oh, I'm trying to get the remote. Just the, this is the remote that it comes with so I can uh, hook it up to my phone. It has an iOS button and it has an Android button. But this is uh, from UB Size. UB Size. And it's, I think it's a, you said a 57 inch tripod or 60 or 72. I don't know, but I got a really tall one. So like if I want to take pictures, they don't have to just be at my level. They could, they could be a little bit over me. So yeah, I wanted to start self taking my photos because I'm trying to get back on taking my photos and taking pictures. I'll be taking um, front camera pictures all the time. Front camera, pic, front camera pictures all the time, but I don't be taking like full body unless like I have people with me. But I don't, I don't be having people with me, so I need to start just doing it for myself, doing it on my own, and learn how to take my own pictures. So y'all gonna be seeing full body pictures of me coming soon. I gotta insert to y'all. I gotta insert the pictures that I just took for uh my get ready with me. It was my getting ready me and my AliExpress haul. But those were like front camera pictures, but they was bomb. I did the thing. So I'm going to insert those because the video will already be out by the end. Yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Like I said, it's not much to do today. This was all I was doing. We'll catch up tomorrow and tomorrow's a long day. So let's just, let's just get there. So good morning, you guys. Uh, today is Tuesday. It's officially the day I get my hair done. Y'all saw me blow dry my hair yesterday, so all that is done. I still gotta go to the beauty supply to get some braiding hair, so that's what I'm gonna do. It's like 8.40, so it's not 9. The beauty supply opens at 9, so I'm gonna go to the bank first. I'm gonna go to the bank because I gotta get cash to pay her the remaining balance, and then, and then, and then, and then. Then I gotta do some orders, some of the grease orders from people who did deliveries and stuff. A lot of people are paying now, so I'm just, I'm over here writing stuff down right now. Okay, so a lot of people are paying now, so um, I got to drop off three of them today for sure. And, um, yeah. I got to drop off some Greeks orders, and I'm also doing lunch with my friends, and I got to go, look at my hair. I knew it wasn't going to stay, that scarf. Um, and then I got to go all the way to the south side to get my hair done Ugh, it's like a whole hour drive <laughs> it's like 53 minutes but it was the only appointment that i could find for spring break and i really wanted some box braids so so be it um but yeah that's the agenda for today i'm bringing you guys along with me i'm gonna just hurry up and get started wash my face brush my teeth book I'm on the road and already I'm leaving now on the way to the bank. Y'all, I feel like a real business owner. Is it business owner? It's business owner. Business. I feel like a business person. I don't know. I feel like a business owner selling these greases. Like, we really trying to get them out. We've been shipping it to so many people that do want to ship because there's people like some of my friends or whatever. They want their ship because they don't live in the Houston area. That's why I was telling y'all, if y'all do want to grease, um, and y'all want it to be shipped, we can do that. You just don't have to pay extra $5 for shipping. Um, but yeah, I really feel really, really good. I'm so happy that all you guys are supporting, well, the people that are supporting the grease business, uh, cause it's just $10 and it's really shit. That grease is the shit. Like, like it's going really, really good. Like, per y'all just coming 
through and I appreciate it so much because this is what I always wanted because my mom been having her grease business uh like I said since I was a baby like this is the only grease I have ever used and with the grease business um she been having it since I was young however I did not know when I was young she was trying to do what I'm doing for her right now she was trying to jump start it off kick it off however and she was trying to go through the right things like the legal things to get her recipe patent and everything um but something happened with the lawyer like she said she said she had went and got a lawyer and everything so she could get it patent but something happened like it went wrong and he just like i don't know what happened but she told me it didn't go well and then she kind of just left it off after that that was when i was a child so we're gonna try to restart this thing get a patent and i want to really get a website up um, because, like, say, for instance, the people that we're shipping it to, we're shipping it to at least two or three people already. And it's just, like, we can really ship it to everybody because trying to do this drop-off and pick thing, picking up stuff, it's not, first of all, I trust everybody that I sent, um, that I told people that come pick up from my house. I trust all those people. Don't get it mistaken. But, let's say, if it continues to keep growing and I bring in these new customers, like, people that I don't really know, or that was sent to by other people that's the people that I'm not gonna be trusted to just send out my address to like right now so the drop-off and delivery thing it's not gonna be able to last long as far as people coming to our house and then you know people in Houston live everywhere like you can live in Houston but you could still be 30 45 minutes away so yeah we definitely want to do the shipping thing I think that'd be much easier on us to ship it out and plus if you're shipping out to people in Houston anyway it won't even take long uh, so yeah that's that's what's going on with the grease business I'm so happy for it that is doing good this is something I always wanted for my mom like eventually it's gonna be like a big business it's gonna grow uh, it's gonna be we're gonna you know I'm not gonna say all the plans but it's gonna be like I'm just gonna say it's gonna be a whole hair care thing because my mom she's been blessed with the spirit of growing people hair okay you guys I made it out spent fucking $65 I mean, to be fair, I did buy this, like, this freaking, um, tracksuit sweat. It's like a loud pink. I like it. And I got all these beads. Hopefully, this is enough to do my hair. Because y'all know, um, the beads that I ordered online was too freaking big from Amazon. So, these are the size that I was looking for. And I got, like, this tan and this. Like, I wanted wood ones and, like, a light color. I didn't really, I don't want to do the clear. That's kind of what everybody's doing. And then hopefully she don't get mad because, uh, I got this hair, the outre one. But I saw on her website the, that this is the hair that she accepts. But for the style that I put, it said to get the Rue braiding hair. But they don't have, the, they had the Rue braiding hair. Then they have the inch she wanted. She said 28 inch. They only had a 24. And I don't want my braids to be short. I'm just letting you know I'm going to go to Silver Springs. Yeah, I know. I'm around with Taylor. I'm gonna leave right now. What is Silver Springs? Silver Springs. It's like so you is not going no damn Silver Springs. No, nah, man. I'm just letting you know for real, for real. You ain't letting me know nothing. You ain't going to no Silver Springs. Silver Springs is three hours away. Girl, you lit as hell this morning. No, you lit. Calling me talking about some Silver Springs. Ain't yeah, nothing yeah. in Silver Springs out there for you. Lower your tone. Mm hmm You like my new U of H hat? Yeah, where you get that from? Okay, so I'm here at El Refu at the place I'm supposed to have lunch with my friends with. I only got two more orders left. Uh but the uh one of the orders is for a friend here that's already here. It's grease on this one. And then the other one is also for another friend that's here too, so yeah that's the grease orders so i'm gonna head into the restaurant because i see pia is already here and i'll see you guys when i get in i already started eating i have forgot to vlog karen reminded me <laughs> who got a 
can play in a match. Oh wow, I that's not even surprising. She so I made it, I was early, I made it like a 3.05, but I've been sitting in the car for the longest because, just because, I don't want to go in there, I was trying to rest a little bit, I'm going to go to the restroom, my phone be telling me late as fuck. Y'all, so I'm finished, um, uh, y'all can't really see me and I'm not liking this lighting, but, oh, hold on. It is so, my hair is so pretty. I got to show y'all when I get home. But I got the beads on there. And it's like exactly how I want it. I'm so glad that I got like the wood beads instead of the clear beads. But I really want to show y'all when I get home. So I'm going to see y'all when I get home because I got a good drive. It's going to take me about 50 minutes to get home. And just like I predicted, actually I predicted later. I didn't get out of my appointment to 7.48. I thought I was going to get up at least by 7. No. But thank God today, like, save as y'all can see. It's still kind of a little blue in the sky. Probably by the time I get home, it'll be dark. So I'm going to see y'all when I get home so y'all can see my braids a little better. I finally made it home. Oh, my God. I'm so glad to be home. I can finally show y'all my braids and some good lighting or whatever. So there they go. And then if I wanted to do a little flip over. There she go. It's so neat and just really good she was so professional like out of all the people that braided my hair she's like the most professional she was like asking me that i need to go to the restroom and she did my braids i i'm learning that like people that be doing braids now they just getting lazy and lazier they don't even be dipping your braids no more you're supposed to dip it in hot water so they last longer but she did it they just so pretty and long I gotta show y'all in the mirror. This is me. My bathroom is a mess, but this is the girl. She's cute. She's so cute. So I'll see y'all guys tomorrow. Tomorrow is another long day. Today I didn't get home to 8:41, so basically nine. Tomorrow is another long day, but I won't be as out as like long, like coming home late. Tomorrow I gotta get a wax. Tomorrow I gotta go to the liquor store. Tomorrow I gotta go to the grocery store. And that's the wrap after that. But my wax is also late like my braid appointment was today. My wax is at 3.30. Again, that's all she had. Because I am not one to make late appointments like that. I usually just won't even go if, if all they have is late appointments. But because it's spring break weekend and I needed it, I... I'm doing late appointments. Plus, I don't have work, so I don't really have no excuse or whatever. But, um, yeah, I'll definitely see y'all guys tomorrow when I got myself together. And, yeah. The next day. Okay, good morning, guys. It's day three. We in this thing or whatever. So, I'm, on, I'm currently up in, in the car. I know I usually start talking to y'all in the house. But, oh, these beats. Um, but, you know, I kind of got a little lazy. Um, and I was just laying in the bed enjoying my time. Because I, yesterday, y'all know, I didn't get home till like 8.40, basically 9 o'clock. I was so tired and I just didn't want to get up today. Because today is similar to yesterday. Except I'm just not going to be as out as late. But I'm still going to be out running around. And I don't know why I just make it hard on myself because I added some things in for me to do today and then took some things out that needed to really needed to be done today. Y'all let me show y'all the sky. I made it to where I to get the liquor, but look at the sky. This is how today looks. So ugly. I'm gonna honestly be pissed off because um I don't even know what's going on with my camera right now. My camera went acting so freaking stupid lately. Like, it's just been, like, overheating a lot. Like, or saying that it's, like, too hot. It needs to cool down. And then, like, it'll just turn off. And then, like, it'll just stop recording. So, like, say I'm recording right now. It'll just stop for me and go black screen. I don't even know why. And so, it's been doing that. So, I've just been switching out with my phone or whatever. But then, like, I go to look for the files, and it keeps saying unable to display, unable to display, like, to where I can't view it on my camera. 
I'm hoping that even though it's saying unable to display and I can't view it on my camera, I still can pull the files up on my computer. Otherwise, like, that means that this vlog won't be going up and I'm really going to be upset. Uh, my camera probably acting up because it's no, it knows that I'm trying to get another one by, um, uh, I wasn't at one, but I put one. Mm -hmm. At the liquor, it's starting to rain on my windshield a little bit. Look at this beautiful news. <laughs> so I got the liquor. Let's go to the grocery store, which is back on my side. I'm going to just see how I'm going to get to the grocery store because I'm trying to save energy on my camera, I guess. Oh my God, it's raining. Here she comes. Yes. Okay, right, like you had a order, right? okay, thank you. Oh, this is like the devil. It's making it rain more. Sorry. She put it all in my trunk. I didn't want it in my trunk. But whatever this plastic. I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. So I'm back. Is my camera cloudy? Hold up on the way to my 3 o'clock 3.30 appointment for my wax or whatever. I just currently dropped one of my grease orders off to uh, her house or whatever. And yeah. Oh my um, god, I love Beyonce. Look, it's, it's pictures of her up here. This is my favorite picture of her. So this Let is me see. That I said was going to stay up here. Oh, that is a cute picture. I don't know my favorite Beyonce. Cute. Oh, look at Tiana Taylor. Mm -hmm. And look behind you. Oh, Erica Badu. <laughs> Her pretty eyes. Right? That is so cute. So I'm gonna put um, Jill Scott in this one. Mm -hmm. I, get the, I don't want you to get the fact that I work for him. <laughs> um, I think I'm gonna put Lauren Hill in that one. Mm -hmm. I want a picture, that's Janelle Monae right there. And then in that one, I think I'm gonna put a picture of Angela Rye, cause I love her. Um, <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, that's cute. I didn't even see that. Have to come get some of these no, I'm gonna go come get a Yanni. I didn't, I didn't, I saw it, but I just never got one before. Yeah, well, it's a herbal detox for your one. And I want the uh, the Jason. Yeah, and then we have three different blends. Mm -hmm. and you can mix any two of the blends in any combination. So there is a dismantle, which is a detoxing blend, a honey dripper that's equivalent to you eating your pineapple, so that works to make you taste and smell sweet. Mm -hmm. And then the supernova is if you need a little help with your moisture, that it gives you that gush. Uh, okay. <laughs> Okay. 